within my committee was able to hear over 138 bills that came through that body just to, for you to get an idea of what um, the people in the state of Minnesota are wanting to hear and the solutions that we need to do to make sure that we are creating more fair and equitable outcomes for the families around the state of Minnesota. Um, within this bill, you definitely will see some policies and practices around ensuring that we are keeping kids safe in their homes, but also supporting kinship care, creating a pathway for reestablishment of uh, parental rights. But, uh, and um, I, I think that's a, a good place for us to be as we know that when we look at health care, health care is more of a holistic, comprehensive approach about creating outcomes, not only in health care, but within our educational system, within the workforce, uh, but also back in our communities. So I, as we look at the, the bills that are in health care, we look at the doulas. We know that doulas have not been reimbursed at the same rate. Uh, we look at birth rates. That is really, really important within the African-American commu community as we look at low birth rates and low death of infants. We are solving that problem within this bill today uh, uh, and during this session. So my hope is we continue to look at, look at how we create access for health care for everyone across the state of Minnesota, that we're also looking at the impacts and disparities that are facing so many communities of color across the state of Minnesota.